Two of the trial of Julian Hernandez kicked off today. Hernandez is accused of second degree murder of a police officer. Today we found out just how fast Hernandez and officer David Nelson were going before the deadly crash. 23 ABC Scott Sheehan was in court and joins us now live with more Scott. Jessica and court we learned that those pursuit speeds got over 100 miles an hour. A detective testified saying that he used three different surveillance cameras to estimate the speeds at 102, 91 and 66 miles per hour and that they ran at least one stop sign. Now this morning's hearings moved slow as they showed the math to estimate those speeds, but it then picked up in the afternoon when the prosecution brought in three officers to testify about prior run ins with Hernandez. They testified that he ran away from the police on two different occasions, once in 2004 and another in 2010. Both times the officer said that they had to use force to detain Hernandez and the third officer testified that Hernandez was in his custody when Hernandez asked to fight an officer officer out of his uniform. During today's proceedings, Hernandez sat quietly at the defense desk, writing things down and occasionally handing notes to the, his lawyer. When I talked to his lawyer, he told me off camera that the prosecution has still yet to show any evidence that Hernandez wanted to harm Officer Nelson during the pursuit where Officer Nelson crashed and died. When I talked with the prosecution, he told me that he will answer all of my questions after the trial has finished. Now the prosecution is expected to continue with his witnesses tomorrow morning at 930 and is only expected to go about a half of a day before the court takes a week long recess starting next week. Outside the courthouse, Scott Sheehan, 23 ABC News.